Hello, oh, welcome back to Goldborn. Last time, we started dealing with our military, which is a stressful thing all on its own. Um, this time, we're going to set up our second military, probably. Um, and once we do that, we'll probably have our 20 military dwarves all set up and ready to go. Case In case of invasion, our 20 military dwarves, but... Uh, I mean, we already have, like, 20 idlers anyway, so if we take at least 10 of those idlers that are doing nothing and setting them into the military, probably a, benef probably a beneficial thing to do. It's not like we don't have enough food or, you know, armor and stuff. No, go away. I suppose we could set up a tavern, too. We haven't done that. Uh, probably think about doing that. Um, he was still complaining about not having metal objects to melt. I guarantee you all have metal objects to melt. I've not made a single masterwork in... Why do they always stick it in the furthest possible gem stockpile? There's one right there that they could use, but no, they gotta run all the way over there. Yeah, whatever. Alright, so they're about halfway done the Iron Helms. When they're done completely with those, we'll, uh... Actually, no, you know what? I could just... Yeah, this is already set up. I could just set them up on uh, wrestling training, I suppose. Siege engineer. What, what, why are you out of your... Why do they always switch out of their stuff? I don't know. Oh, it's the third month. That's why. Because they're no longer uh, supposedly training. Although they're still individual combat drilling, so... Uh, Alright, so let's set up our second military. Uh, which I guess is our militia com Do we have a militia commander? We do. Okay, so we do actually have a militia commander. No uniforms. Uh, so you're our militia commander. Congratulations. Uh, let's go find some guys who aren't doing anything else. Uh, the green means they're in other squads, I guess. Oops. No, 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 no. Uh, move you from squad. Alright. Glassmaker. Probably don't need all these sutures, but... Um, hmm. <laughs> Put our scholar in the military. No, let's not do that. Uh, wood burner's probably not needed. Messenger, broker, dancer, mason, strand extractor. No need for you. Uh, wax worker, paper makers, cheese maker. Yeah, definitely don't need you. Uh, thresher, maybe? Yeah, stick you in there anyway. Peasant. <laughs> we don't need so many. We have so many uh, guys, so couple furnace operators, uh... Looking for people who have useless jobs. Ranger, that'll work. Alright, you're all ready to go. Um... Alright, so you're all in there. Now we can schedule you, or not schedule. Uh, let's get out of that. Alerts, training, you're both gonna be training. Uh... We need a schedule... for... you guys. And I want you... Uh, so I'll set it so you guys don't train on the first of the month. Or the first month, and the other guys don't train on the third month. You'll both be training on the second month. Um, and I'll set up the place you're supposed to be for that. Right, supplies, we want you guys to carry water and three food. Um... And then equipment. So you guys don't have any uniforms, but I think we have enough swords for you guys. Um, all right, so it's five, and we're actually going to need one of you guys is not going to have a weapon. Uh, Unfortunately. So one of you guys is going to be learning how to be a, uh, a wonderful brawler until, uh, until we get you another weapon. I guess I could give you a pick. I could give you an iron pick. Uh, nah, I'll just, just got to tell you guys to forge. Um, 
Alright, and then make barracks for you guys. Mechanical points. Train. Nope. Wrong button. Uh, squad equip. Individual equip. Uh, that's mechanical points. Can I guess I could train you all in the same area, but that just seems kind of dumb. So I'll give you your own training area. Um, so they should be moving in there anytime now. Or did I not set the alert? Oh, there they go. Okay, there they go. They're all in there. All training. <laughs> Bunch of wrestlers. Uh, Mace Dwarf. Alright, well, you're all going to be training up more petitions for guys who eradicate monsters that we're never going to kill. Rule one, never open the caves. <laughs> if you can avoid it, don't open the caves. At least not until you have a military, which I don't, so... Um, you done making helms yet? You're not. Oh, God. Uh, all of these are bad, so it's melt them. I wish there was a way to just say auto-melt if, uh, if they were less than good. Just auto-melt them. Yeah, just melt all that. <laughs> I suppose I could have melted the steel picks, but I'm not going to, so... Here, you melt those too. <laughs> Alright, Forge Iron Helm is done, so we can do Steel Warhammer. Uh, actually. So we're going to have two. Let's make uh, more Steel Short Swords too. So we'll tell them to forge that, and we'll uh, get on... Get on the ball with all of that. Alright, are you done encrusting things? You are. Okay. So since they're done encrusting things, we'll go back to making totems. Uh, we have all these bones we're not using. I wonder if I should do something else with them instead of making rings. Uh, we can make bone figurines. We could also decorate with bone. Actually, you know what? We're going to do that. We're going to decorate with bone. That's why type bands. You can decorate. You can decorate things with bone with bands of bones on them. Actually, wait, no, don't do that. <laughs> I should really thought about it. just remove that for a second. Wait till you're done making all the shitty totems, uh, and then once you're done doing that, we can uh, have you do other things. And once you're done making totems, we'll uh, we'll dump the ones that we don't. We'll dump the terrible ones, and then we'll go from there. Uh, Dodged a bullet there. Um, hmm. Okay, so just gotta let them do their thing. <laughs> More human spearmen, just what I didn't want. God, they do melt things very quickly. Still making totems. Uh, I don't think they've actually made any, like, masterwork weapons yet, so... Yes, yes, I know, you don't have any objects to melt. Stop spamming it every five seconds. Oh good, they've mastered Masterpiece Steel Warhammer, that's nice. Uh... Oh good, another boy. More children. More children to feed. Uh... Oh god, we got so much food and drink. How much? We got 6,500 6, drink. Almost, so. Petitions. No. Absolutely not. Oh good, another child. <laughs> That's the good news about having a dormitory. All the dwarves just fuck in there. So it's less about a door. It's also a dormitory and more just an orgy. <laughs> just a constant open door orgy. Uh, Alright, so they made the weapons. Alright, melt the terrible ones. We all have 11 steel war hammers that are good. Uh, 
We have 19 there. Swords that are good. Okay. Um, so, I should... Uh, give it another second or so. And... Uh, we'll go back to smelting them. So... Well, I jumped the gun a bit on the swords. Alright, so that's fine. So now that we did that, we can set our military guy who doesn't have a weapon. Uh, yeah, you're going to be our Warhammer guy. Congratulations, you now have a weapon. Uh, replace clothing. Okay. Probably that is fighting. Alright, whatever. Uh, so they're doing that. So that'll smelt down all of those. Uh, I guess it's back to making iron helms. Iron helms forever. Until one of you learns how to do uh, masterwork armor. So once we get masterwork armor, we can actually start, like, cla cladding our dwarves? Clothing our dwarves? It's clad is past tense, so... Ban on certain exports. Let's see. I imagine it's Warhammers. Yes, it's Warhammers. That's all, my That's all the mayor ever does, is he bans Warhammers for export. Uh, I wonder if I should start making, like, spears instead. Like, spears or... Can I make whips? I don't know. Let's see. Uh, oh, I can't make steel whips. Uh, so I'm not sure how they're everywhere in uh, other places. You can make battle axes... Maces, spears. Uh, hmm. Interesting. Uh, I don't know if I should make spears or maces. I don't think either one of the. I have to check. I, don't, I should probably check the weapons. Honestly, I should probably look. So, edge weapons or blunt weapons? I don't know what the best weapons are. I always thought it was Warhammers, all things considered. Um, uh, 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 so how about you just tell me what the best ones are? Not foreign weapons. Training weapons. Why would you ever use training weapons as opposed to, uh... Is there some benefit for training weapons? Uh... Only use when you have no metal weapon of the kind. Yeah, okay, so... <laughs> okay, so... What, training weapons are useless. Alright. Um... Uh... Uh... I'm not sure... <laughs> the problem is I have no idea what's the best. Easy, easy way to look at this. More fortune. You start looking like you start delving down the rabbit hole of the wiki trying to figure out what all this crap is. Uh material attack type, blunt weapon, best weapon. Yeah, I already know all this. It's not uh So I should be using axes not swords basically. I mean that's what I'm looking at. Basically what I was looking at was whether or not I should be using swords, or whether or not I should be using, like, like, the difference between a mace and a warhammer, or the difference between a sword and an axe. Um, axes are better at hacking things than swords are. Uh, they don't have piercing, is the problem. They have no stabbing ability with a, with a war, with a, uh, the battle axe. So I'm not sure if I should do that, or if I should make spears, or something. 
I suppose if I'm gonna have two, it's actually not. So if I could have, if I have two, uh, I suppose since I have two uh, separate sets of dwarves all doing things, I I could uh, I could just train all of them. There's always that. Uh, I don't know if that's what I'm going to do though. I guess after I'm done doing the Iron Helms, I'll probably tell them... Yeah, I guess after I do the Iron Helms, I'll tell them to do other things. Are we done making totems? We are. Okay. Uh... Take over the totems. So we'll just have them haul them on their own. Um... These dwarves, man, they're just like, I want to melt objects, why don't you let me melt to them? I'm going to check every three seconds. See whether or not I can do it, because I have nothing else to do, aside from yelling about how I have nothing to melt. Actually, is there a way to auto-melt stuff? There is. Oh, okay, auto-melt on. Um, wait a second. Settings. So this is armor. Um. Can you? Wait, what? No. No, this is an armor stockpile. No, oh, because that's made out of metal, that's why. <laughs> um, oh, core quality. Okay, so anything in here... Okay, so basically what we need to set this to is... No masterworks, no artifacts. So, no masterworks or artifacts in here. Um, anything that's below masterwork or artifact level, uh, we can melt. Because we don't need that. Uh, so that's all going to be auto-melted and we can set the same thing here I think so weapons, armor core quality not masterworks and not artifacts anything else can be auto-melted uh, but this also means that we now need to set up a new stockpile for weapons and armor I did not know I had to learn something new today uh, no bins or barrels, obviously. Um, settings. Was this weapons? No, it's. Oh, that's why it's. Just, that would explain it. Uh, I was dumb and made a wood stockpile. That's not what I want. Get rid of that. Uh, weapon is P, not W. Alright, settings. Uh, no max bins. Settings. Weapons, core quality, turn off everything except masterworks and artifacts. So all those can go away. Um, and then we need a armor stockpile for the same thing. So only the masterworks and the artifacts. And everything else goes in the auto melt. Actually, that's gonna melt picks too, isn't it? Hmm. Yeah, probably. Hmm. I guess it just means we have to smelt some picks that aren't terrible. Uh. Mark six items to melt. Oh, good. So. That's good. I guess it'll tell me every time we do that. Wait, no, 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 no. No bins. Forgot about that. Um, it's going to constantly tell me it marked items to melt, isn't it? 
Uh, well, they're still forging iron. So once they're done forging the iron helms, we'll forge the uh, picks again. It's just going to keep telling me forever that it marked items to be melted, didn't it? <laughs> okay. Uh, what was the other options? Auto trade? Yeah, I don't care about that. I'm not going to set them to be auto traded. Uh, actually, deny. I don't know what auto trade does automatically, so I don't want to like. Alright, bone, decorate with bone. But the reason I don't want to do auto trade is I'm not sure if, if it'll do it immediately upon. Uh, uh, like, I have no idea if it's just going to be like the guy shows up or if only if I designate it to be traded or if it'll just keep shit there while uh, while there's a trader there to be use doing stuff. Um. Oh crap! I, I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Decorate with bone details. The type bands. <laughs> Whoops. Now this is not going to improve things all that much, but uh, that's okay. I think we we, I think the problem is that we've hit a thing where the amount of people trying to melt things is far greater than the amount of people trying to uh, forge things. So... What I probably should do is just get rid of these smelters. <laughs> so there's fewer people doing checks for that. That's honestly what I should do. Um, so hopefully that'll, that'll slow down the amount of checks we keep getting for things. Um, are there really only... Six of these. We only have six that are left. I guess all of them are in the hands of other people, so... I guess that makes sense. Um, did we run out of barrels or something? Are they still making drink? Or are just, our brewers are just not very good at brewing? Oh, they're still brewing, apparently. I'm back. What are you doing? That's a baby. Why are you carrying a baby while you're brewing? Brew drink from fruit. Are you a good brewer? You're a talented brewer. That's the best we can do. Oh, well, it's okay. Brewer, brewing's not worth money anyway. Um, Alright, they forged all the iron helms. That's fine. Uh, so now we're going to make some steel uh, spears, I guess? And steel maces, I guess? And steel... Axes, I guess. Actually, we really don't need maces. We have war hammers. So, spears and battle axes on the other hand we need. And then the terrible ones we'll just get rid of. Hooray for auto smelting. Uh, but I think now that we've done that, and we'll set that to be done, they're going to just keep making stuff. Probably going to need more barrels, actually, pretty soon, now that I look at this. Uh, probably going to need to forge more barrels. Although we can make pots or something, we don't actually need to use barrels for a drink. Uh, I just need to use barrels for that. We can actually use like pots and things, but I don't know. I don't know. Um, that's skunk. It is. All right, so our dwarves are all training. I don't know what you all are doing. Uh, Leading dodging demonstration. Yeah, you should probably all... Do you actually have any skills as a dodger? You're a novice dodger, so you're leading a demonstration despite the fact that you're a novice. Why did you remove all of your clothing? <laughs> what? Okay. I know when I said replace clothing, that didn't mean strip naked. <laughs> Uh, it's your inventory. Alright, you have clothing. You're all sweaty. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> the sweat is on literally everything. Oh my god. You haven't even done anything. Why, why are you so sweaty? You're a dabbling swords dwarf and a novice armor user. Novice discipline, and you're like sweating horribly. Tells me all my dwarves are fat and out of shape and have no idea what to do. 
But uh, that's enough for this one. I'm going to cut... Oh, there's steel spears. Yay, masterworks. But yeah, that's going to be uh, next time, I think. And then... Uh, yeah, so next time we're going to keep forging stuff. Uh, hopefully go from there. So yeah. Yeah, that's it. See you all later.